So, congratulations, you got a job here at Appliance Factory Outlet. Now we're going to give you some basic tips on how to use a dolly and move an appliance properly. We're going to move a fridge, a range, a washer, and a dryer. Okay, there are right ways and there are wrong ways. I'm not going to show you the wrong ways because I have no desire to injure myself. Okay, you should not either. So let's concentrate on the proper ways to move these things. Okay, now we're going to show you how to move a washer. Now, like I said, this door doesn't go the way, so it doesn't really matter. But what you want to be careful of is these are generally spring loaded. So if you get it too far over, it might actually want to come bring itself up. That's okay. You can be careful of that, okay? There are two recommended ways that I'd recommend doing this. One, you lift the lid, make sure you set the lid on your hand. Don't leave the lid up here, okay? Make sure you bring it down here. You're going to get a good grip on the metal and you're going to pull back and you're going to step out of it. And obviously, remove your hand slowly because like I said, at this point, it can go anywhere it wants to. And if you pull your hand out fast, it's going to whip up this way. And if I happen to be looking over, I'm getting slapped. And I don't like getting slapped by machines. It's not fun, okay? Put your thing back down and then grab it. And like I said, then we can walk it anywhere we want, okay? And it'll go as long as we have a nice center of, you know, our center of gravity is, you know, done nicely. To put it down, like I said, you can do it one of two ways. You can lift it back up, grab down here, put your foot on the wheel, and then, like I said, use your weight as a counterweight to come over, okay? Using your arms like shock absorbers and let them slowly come out. Don't just, okay? Because it will cause you to flip. The other way is, okay? Same thing with the dryer, okay? Put your foot under here, okay? And like I said, and go against it and slowly bring it down. You don't have to be 240 pounds like me to do this. You can be a lot lighter. It will work. You just have to do it slowly. If you get in a rush and let it drop, it's going to go slam. It goes slam and you're attached to it. It's going to hurt you. You do not want that. We don't want that. We can repair these. You're a whole lot harder to repair. One of the things you do have to watch out for is if this thing starts to fall, it falls off your dolly. You may not have centered it right. You may have run into something. Let it go. Do not try and grab it, okay? Because if you grab it, it weighs more than you. It is going to pull you and throw you and hurt you. Let it fall, okay? Now, no one's gotten fired here for damaging appliance. You do get fired for damaging appliance and not telling anybody, okay? That goes with fridges, all of the other manufacturers, okay? Things happen. We know this. We can live with that. It's to be expected. Okay, we don't like it, but we'll deal with it. So if it does decide it wants to start going over, you can't stop it doing with your dolly. Let it go, let it fall, because like I said, we can replace the door. It's hard to replace anybody, any part of your body that gets damaged, okay? So like I said, nice and easy. Put your foot underneath it, walk into it slowly, and let it come over nice and easily, okay? And that's dolly in 101. You do, you follow that, you won't have any issues, and you won't hurt yourself. Now, you'll see guys doing it differently. I would not stop them myself and say, hey, you're doing it wrong. I would say, hey, go to their boss and say, hey, I saw a guy, he was walking with it behind it, you know, let the management take care of all the issues that might possibly happen. Don't be the one to go, hey, you're doing it wrong. Okay, no one likes that guy. But bring it up to your manager and say, hey, so and so, what guy over there was really, really being, you know, potentially injured himself because we don't want him to get hurt any more than we want you to get hurt. So take your time. Move them correctly, you'll have no problems. Thank you very much.